not everything has to be my video, obviously so. I've got four videos below. Um, you'll really enjoy them. The first two, I really do suggest that you watch from beginning to end. They're actually a really short video. The first video is like two minutes long. And the second video is a uh, veteran power line worker. All of these videos are 100% true. They're not fake. Not only, of course, am I, well, I guess I'm an expert in field theory, right? You have to be to write a popular book on magnetism. Also a, a former ham radio operator. I used to run antennas and coax cables, and I accidentally, at one time, uh, let loose 50 watts of power, and I could immediately feel it in my eyes and my skull. I thought I was broadcasting at two watts power, but it was really 50. So I know a lot about uh, RF induction, um, radio antennas and wireless power transmission. These videos will both shock and amaze you. The first video you'll think, and it's uh, totally in Russian, and the two guys are literally frying themselves. And they're using uh, grass weeds to touch this uh, AM broadcast station in Ukraine. Russians are famous, and I lived in Russia for quite a long while, famous for building super huge AM broadcast stations and transmitting enormous amounts of power, like really powerful. Um, we have stations like that here in the United States, like a Voice of America and some other things. Anyways, uh, probably broadcasting on 1.5 uh, kilowatts is a lot of power. And um, the, uh, the, the weeds that they pluck out from around the antenna that are touching that, they're of course burning, but at the same time you could hear the radio station. The old uh, wives' tale about being able to hear, uh, like some young kid that would have braces on, would be able to uh, pick up a radio station. People think that's actually a lie, you know, it's just like a fairy tale. It's actually completely true. The caveat to that is, is that a, you have to be close, like within two miles, of an AM broadcast station transmitting a lot of power. Now, back in the day, that was not that uncommon. Today, it's a lot less common. Today, it's low power, and it's FM. But the notion of actually opening your mouth up, and some people had intricate braces work, is absolutely true, and uh, it's RF induction from AM broadcast, high power. AM broadcast, and it's no different than wireless power. Really, you really, really will enjoy these two videos. I mean, if you have any curiosity at all. But like I'm telling you, these videos are all completely 100% true. And a lot of people think that they're fake, but they're not. And uh, if you understand uh, wireless power induction and RF radio induction, you'd, under um, you'd, you'd understand this. But uh, it's amazing regardless. Um, the one power line worker video, the guy cusses a little bit, it's, just trust me, at least watch the first two videos, they're pretty short, total of like five minutes for both of them, I think you'll really, really like them. If you want, I'll discuss the principle of these uh, tomorrow in a, another video, but uh, please watch them and I guarantee you'll come away going, wow, that is so cool. I, I'm pretty sure you will. Thanks, bye.